What's up everyone? Welcome back to the channel and today we have 2020-2021 Flux first off the line rip for you guys. We just got this in. I know there's several other videos out there but we were able to get our hands on a box and we wanted to open it up here on the channel. This is the inaugural edition of Flux as a standalone product. Um, Panini has done this product very similar to what they did with Recon where it used to be a subset in Chronicles and now it is own standalone product. Um, we have seen some of the videos that are out there running around right now on YouTube and um, I, I don't know really what to say. I mean, there's some that you're seeing where people are not getting, you know, the one auto, um, which is on average. So there is a chance that you don't get one per box. Um, and then I've seen some other ones where people are just getting some amazing pulls. So it looks like with the size of this checklist um, on the product, you know, there is a pretty wide vari variation in what you're going to get in this product. Um, so I don't know. Let us know in the comments what you guys think after we get done with this. I am going to check it out. I like the design of the Flux cards inside of the Chronicle set and what I have seen so far um, in some videos and preview of the product. I, I think I like the design. Um, probably won't try to collect a ton of them, but we'll probably look to hit a few few select cards um, for our PC. Uh, namely, some Steph Curry cards. Have a couple of our Steph cards that we pulled here on the channel up on display. Um, you know, Mr. All-Time NBA three-point champ. So um, had to put those up there on display since he just broke the, broke the record in Madison Square Garden the other night. Um, with that, before we get into the rip, though, we want to do a quick announcement of our next giveaway. We are going to be doing a holiday giveaway for a 2021 Classics Football H2 Hobby Box here on the channel. This will run December 25th, Christmas morning. We will have a video that posts that will select this, uh, select this winner. So we will be giving that away. All you got to do is subscribe to the channel like and comment on this video and let us know in the comment what you think about this new product and what you think about Panini just spinning off a lot of these Chronicle uh, subsets into their own products. I know a lot of people have said that they wished, you know, that they would like to see them inside of Chronicles because it was one of those things that brought like the different sets to Chronicles. Other people have said that they liked Recon and liked Flux. Um, I'm, I'm still undecided at this point, but with all of that said, let's get to what everyone is actually here for, the product opening. So in this, we get 10 packs, five cards per pack, so 50, uh, 50 cards in the box. There is one encased, uncirculated card that will come in here. Like I said, on average, one auto per box. I have actually seen several rips of this where there hasn't been an auto, um, which is kind of surprising. It's so a 250 total card set, 200 flux base cards, and 50 rookies. Um, and those come with multiple parallels. And then there is the hobby exclusives atmosphere inserts. Those atmosphere inserts come in five different levels, um, if I remember correctly. And the the most rare being exosphere. Um, they have a thermosphere, mesosphere, basically premised off of the atmosphere and in the, the different levels of that there. And then also the ultra rare full capacity inserts. I don't think I have seen anyone pull the pull one of those on any of the videos. Um, so real quick, these regular hobby boxes, which are out on um, eBay and for purchase now, they're selling at around 250 a box. Um, I believe the first off the line boxes went down to almost that when they did the Dutch, Dutch auction on Panini Direct. So real quick, the breakout of this box, there is one autograph on average, one first off the line uncirculated uh, topper card that is numbered to 38 or less, um, four inserts, one of them being an atmosphere insert, and then three additionals, one insert prism. Um, then there is one first off the line exclusive, which is either a purple scope or a gold scope, purple being numbered to 18 and gold being numbered to eight. Um, so we're looking for a gold there. And then there are three silver parallels. Um, so let's let's get to it and see what we got here. Uh, like I said, I opened up Recon quite a bit. Uh, I like the look of Recon. Um, not sure if I like that they split it out of the, the Chronicles set yet. But um, we'll see. 
and then flux they're doing the same thing with and the flux design is i mean it's pretty nice i like the way it's done and this was also one of the like nicer subset cards inside of chronicles um optochrome card not just a base paper card so let's see what we got here Uh, Dennis Smith, and then we start off with our atmosphere inserts, Michael Porter Jr., troposphere, so I think on the back of these, yeah, it shows you the differing levels, um, so five different levels to the atmospheres, now I am Super not excited because of seeing this card. Because uh, one of the videos that I watched that didn't have an auto in the box pulled that card. Um, hopefully, we do not see the same thing. And we got Kmart Jr., Bryant, Thomas Bryant, and George Hill. The, uh, the atmosphere inserts look really nice. I, li I like the way they're done. Nice design to the card. but was definitely looking for the Steph Curry one to add to our PC. And we got Tristan Thompson, Karis LeVert. We have Sadiq Bey, incoming insert. That is one of the rookie inserts. And we have Jerry West. And Kyrie Lewis Jr. for our first rookie. All right, we are two packs in and nothing overly exciting yet. James Harden, Miles Turner, and it looks like we have a Gordon Hayward. I don't believe this is a first off the line exclusive, but it might because it's purple. No, yeah, 14 to 25, purple insert, Gordon Hayward, or purple parallel Gordon Hayward. This is a nice looking card. I definitely like the colors on the style on these cards. And then we got Reggie Perry for our second rookie. So two rookies so far. A nice... Gordon Hayward parallel, but nothing, nothing amazing yet. We had Zach Levine, Corey Joseph, and we have a Giannis fluid insert. That's a nice card. Put that with the inserts there. And we have Ben Simmons and D Wade. All right, so we are on pack number five, halfway through. Right now, our um, Steph Curry cards here on display are not bringing us any any Steph luck out of this box. So we got our third rookie, C.J. Ellaby. Yeah, Mitchell Robinson and Rui finish it out all right we still haven't seen our auto yet we are pack number six mark is smart all right looks like we have our purple scope and it may have two of them back to back ah Five cards, and it's six cards in this pack. So, Malcolm Brogdon, and then we have Mike Conley for a purple scope. That should be out of 18. And then right behind it, we have a Harrison Barnes. So, 
two out of 18 for the Mike Conley. And then Ten out of eighteen for the Harrison Barnes, so that's a little bonus there. Um, Anthony Simons and Saban Lee for our fourth rookie. So two first off the line scope parallels in this box. We got Jalen Brown, Sterling Brown, and then we have a Donovan Mitchell flow motion insert. That is a nice looking insert. So we'll say the insert cards look pretty cool. Then we have Gary Harris and Kmart Jr. Actually, I think... We had him earlier, I think. I may have not set it aside. So it's either five or six rookie cards so far. So we got three packs left. Still haven't seen our auto. And we had Vucevic, Dennis Schroeder, Markel Fultz. Ricky Rubio, and Siakam. All right, this one feels, uh, it feels a little thicker than the other one, but maybe not. And Malik Monk, all right, it looks like we I think this is our auto. Yep, looks like this is our auto. And it is Kim Birch, Ultraviolet. Mm, okay. Um, not the auto we were looking for, but it is an auto. Definitely like the style. Like the look of the card is nice. Um... But definitely not the player we were looking for. So we got Looney, Vince Carter, and CJ McCollum. That is one thing that I noticed um, looking at the checklist. There is a pretty, pretty big checklist on the veteran autos and a lot of like, not necessarily the players that everyone is hunting for, but I mean, it's got to be that way. Can't, every box can't have a Luka in it. So we have a rookie influx Tyrese Halliburton. That is a nice card. So might be the card of the box so far coming out in the last pack. And then we finish out with a Zeke Naji rookie. So I think that was, like I said, seven or eight rookies. Um, Not too bad. Now let's check out what our uncirculated card is let's grab a filler card here so these should be numbered 38 or less and comes in a nice one touch case little flex sticker holding it shut and let's see what we got here it is Isaiah Joe, rookie for the Sixers. It's 11 of 18. So it's a rookie card. That is not bad. Definitely better than some of the other pulls I've seen. Um, not what we were looking for, but we'll take it. So that is what we got for you guys today on this rip for flux. Um, I like the card design. Um, I don't know about the set, like it seems to be like pretty, a pretty large set with a lot of inserts. I think when I looked through the checklist, I, I don't know, I lost count of how many inserts, um, 
like insert sets there is in this product, uh, which makes the product like really like have a lot of cards. So it makes it difficult to get some of the cards that you're looking for. Um, and that is, this is one of the other major, like I wouldn't say complaints, but comments that I've seen a lot of people make is that there's just so many inserts that, you know, you get insert after insert after insert, but there's just so many of them that it's like difficult to get the ones that you really want, um, which is like, I admit it, it's, it's part of the chase. And it what is what part of makes it fun is, you know, trying to, trying to chase down the cards that you're looking for. But with all of that said, let us know in the comments what you guys think. And don't forget to get entered into our giveaway that we will be doing on December 25th, Christmas morning. We'll be giving away the Classics H2 Hobby Box. Um, let us know in the comments what you think of this product. As always, we appreciate all the support and we will see you guys next time.